three areas that we, we collaborated on were uh, hands-on training, where we have supplies and, and uh, other resources that we otherwise would not have been able to secure. We also are contracting with uh, Gravitech for um, high angle rescue, emergency descent type training. And then the third area was Eartech, which is a company that provides uh, technology and insight training for gearbox failures, identifying uh, gearbox failures and applying those to a real world application. In the past few weeks, I actually erected a, a, our wind energy training tower on the Canby campus, and it's a base section of a tube tower that was donated to our program. We had it modified at SMI and Hydraulics in Porter, Minnesota, to incorporate two different types of climbing units, climbing ladders, and then also we were um, donated a state-of-the-art Avanti lift cage that will be installed shortly as well. So our students are excited about it. They'll get a lot of opportunity to climb on it in different ways. Um, we're also hoping the industry will be able to utilize it and find it of value as well. Two years ago, the world changed. When, when the markets tipped upside down and we went through the, the mother of all corrections, everything changed. And Outland's been able to sustain steady growth throughout that entire market collapse. We've not only maintained staff but we've been able to grow and that growth has been in part due to the, the partnerships that we have locally our vendor base which includes Minnesota West because they're able to supply us high quality service technicians trained hard-working honest guys that understand what it means to deliver value to a project owner uh, just this year we added two classes that now require students to come to the Canby campus for a climbing lab before, it was just strictly online, um, and then we met with our advisory board, which is made up of industry professionals, and they kind of said, you know, without the hands-on climbing experience, those students really don't offer us as much as we need. So could you really incorporate some type of hands-on experience for them? And so our instructors and our administration went with that. They added that to the curriculum. Um, so this spring actually will be our first cohort group of Winsmith students coming to the campus and getting and completing that climbing lab and safety training right in Canby.